Officer Cesar, City Heads on track 80276, strength 2, inbound. On October 25th, 2023, the U.S. Navy Program Executive Office Integrated Warfare Systems and U.S. Missile Defense Agency successfully conducted Vigilant Wyvern in a landmark display of missile defense capability. Designated as Flight Test Aegis Weapon System 48, or FTM-48, Vigilant Wyvern represented one of the largest integrated air and missile defense engagements in the U.S. Indo-Pacific Command area of responsibility to date. Conducted at the Pacific Missile Range Facility off the coast of Kauai, Hawaii, Vigilant Wyvern demonstrated the capability of one of the Navy's newest Arleigh Burke-class guided missile destroyers, the USS Carl M. Levin DDG-120. Utilizing multiple Standard Missile 3 or SM-3 Block 1As and Standard Missile 2 or SM-2 Block 3As, USS Carl M. Levin was able to detect track and engage two short-range ballistic missile targets, while concurrently demonstrating an anti-air warfare engagement of two subsonic anti-ship cruise missile drone targets. Vigilant Wyvern, or FTM-48, demonstrated for the first time a concurrent ballistic missile defense and anti-air warfare raid, utilizing an Aegis ship operating in integrated air and missile defense priority mode. U.S. Navy destroyer USS Carl M. Levin is positioned off the coast of Kauai, Hawaii. Meanwhile, many miles away at the Pacific Missile Range facility, two targets launch towards USS Carl M. Levin, then loiter, representing a possible cruise missile attack. At almost the same time, two additional targets, representing a ballistic missile threat, launch toward the same intended area of attack. Immediately, the ship's Spy-1 radar and Aegis combat system identify and track the four targets, sending a warning to the watchstanders. Crew members on board USS Carl M. Levin detect the two short-range ballistic missile targets. Fireball times 2 is called in response. At nearly the same time, the USS Carl M. Levin detects the cruise missile threat as the two other targets approach. Vampire Strength 2 is called out in response. The defending ship shifts to auto-engage to allow the Aegis weapon system to prosecute engagements on all four targets. The ship's tactical action officer rolls the fire inhibit switch to green, and the firing circuit is closed. Eagles away! USS Carl M. Levin launches two SM-3 Block 1As to counter the ballistic missile threat. Then, birds away is called as the ship launches four SM-2 Block 3As towards the cruise missile threat. The Aegis ship provides guidance information and illumination to support the interceptors as they soar toward the targets. Mark India! Mark India! The four SM-2s intercepts its designated cruise missile threat targets. Mark India! Mark India! is called as each of the two SM-3s intercepts its designated ballistic missile threat target. Four direct hits! The entire raid defeated! This test demonstrated for the first time a near simultaneous anti-air warfare and ballistic missile defense raid defeat, representing a critical step in defending against multiple targets in a realistic coordinated attack. For USS Carl M. Levin, the complex test also represented the final requirement for its combat system ship qualification trial, validating the capability of the ship and its stellar crew. As potential U.S. adversaries develop tactics to prevent our afloat ballistic missile defense platforms from protecting critical defended areas, tests like Vigilant Wyvern are used to demonstrate a full spectrum of capability to counter advanced ballistic missile threats while simultaneously being able to conduct self-defense from a low-flying cruise missile raid. Vigilant Wyvern highlighted the Aegis integrated air and missile defense capability combined with the professionalism of the USS Carl M. Levin crew to build confidence in the missile defense system and demonstrate the commitment of the U.S. Navy and Missile Defense Agency to defend the United States, its deployed forces, allies, and friends from missile attacks. Aegis Ballistic Missile Defense, on target.